Got it here, brownie maker. How cool is that? Let's see if it actually works. Looks like I got it from Amazon. Looks like one of those waffle makers, but for the brownies, okay? Looks like they're giving you recipes and it says it will take approximately 15 to 17 minutes to cook. So I got that here brownie mix. Then one fourth cup of water it says over there. One third cup of vegetable oil. And an egg. And then mix it up. And it's going to look something like this. Okay, and let's put it in into this little forms. See what happens. I know they're going to rise a little bit, so I gotta be careful not to overfill it. I know it's easier, oven or this thing. It's just another gadget that you have to have. But nevertheless, for these people who really want one of this, instead of cooking in the oven, there you go, let's see if it works. Okay, hopefully I don't overfill it. I might have a little bit, because it will rise. And it's on. And let's wait 15 to 18 minutes. Okay, 18 minutes in. Whoa, check this out. Looks like little pieces of bread. How do we take it out? Okay, got one of these spatulas. Guess what, I didn't overfill it at all. That's so cool. I probably could cook it a little bit longer. But there you go. Um, yeah, it's still moist on the inside. So I could just leave it be and let it cool off for a minute. Maybe this way. Yeah, just still very, very soft. So maybe cook it a little bit longer. Okay, I'm gonna leave it sit there for a minute and taste test real quick with this ones. I've never cooked brownie like that. Mm-hmm, mm, it's hot. Kinda doughy still, and I've been cooking it for 18 minutes still. So maybe I would let it sit in there a little bit longer. Mm, but it's delicious. Okay, they kind of cooled off a little bit. Now the only question is, how do I take it out to where they look so good? Oh wow, look at that. Actually come out pretty good. Let's try another one right here. It doesn't stick or anything. Boom. Pretty nice. One more. Boom. There you go. Brownie cooker right here. Pretty awesome.